Now for a look at your top 10 headlines in just two minutes. In the wake of recent gun violence in schools, a sign posted outside Leotada Floyd Elementary School in Sacramento has neighbors shocked. It reads, no trespassing, violators will be shot and prosecuted, and shows an image of a gun. Chaos during the filming of a music video in Fairfield last night. Two people shot, one person is dead. After the incident on Enterprise Drive near Allen Witt Park, police have not named a suspect. A family of three, including a six-year-old girl, were shot to death while camping at an Iowa State Park. The suspect was found dead by police with a self-inflicted gunshot wound. And the Topps Grocery Store in Buffalo, New York has reopened for the first time since May after a gunman who later admitted racist motivation opened fire killing 10 and wounding three others. Johnny Depp will appeal a court ruling to pay $2 million to ex-wife Amber Heard, this coming a day after she appealed the verdict in the defamation trial against her. Legal experts don't think either appeal will be successful. Former President Donald Trump and former Vice President Mike Pence on the campaign trail in Arizona yesterday, both vying for competing Republican gubernatorial candidates, and Trump offered a hint at a 2024 presidential run. Two Americans have died in the fight for Ukraine. Their platoon members say the fighters were surrounded and say Russia's heavy artillery power is making the fight in western Ukraine difficult and deadly. They're calling on the U.S. to send more aid. And extreme temperatures across Europe, fueling wildfires in Greece, coastal islands near Turkey evacuated this week, and in the mountains near Athens, hundreds forced to flee. $790 million, that's the Mega Millions jackpot. Experts say the winner should put their ticket in a safe place and consult a professional before cashing in. And 50 satellites launched out of this world by Elon Musk's SpaceX, all carried into space by a single rocket that touched back down on a platform in the Pacific. It broke SpaceX record for launches in a year. And that's a look at your top 10 headlines in just two minutes.